And we're back. So we've got our agent, Amanista Barco, out here checking out Greece. Let's see what's going on at Corinth. Nothing. Oh, we've got Visigoths. Oh, interesting. Perhaps the Visigoths will trade with us. Let's give it a shot. Hey, Visigoths. Let's I trade. welcome you, worthy speaker. I listen because your people are... Wow, they don't want to have no aggression. Let's trade. It'll be good. Okay. Wow. Wow. All right. So basically, last time, uh, we've we've been dealing with food problems. So we're creating some fishing ports in uh, Tingis. Hopefully, that'll alleviate the problem. I believe we're also working on it here at Tarako. Well, we have two forums here at Tarako. So perhaps we should uh, dismantle one of those and then uh, once we have money, convert the other one into a plaza. We should have enough money next turn, I think. Well, anyway. Ready for battle. At your command. Where, where's our fleet? Ah, there it is. Recuperating. That'll take a while. Ready for orders. So we've got the horns of Gurzil there. We've got Hispania right here. We could we could go up there and take Narbo from the rebels. At your command. But that might be overstretching ourselves a bit. I really wish the Morians would just take Palma before the rebels do. Perhaps if the uh, rebels take it, I'll move in. Work on it. So yeah, I'd say... We're doing all right. We just have to uh, consolidate our new gains, and by that I just mean finish those fishing ports. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, I also forgot. I forgot about our new front that opened up. It's been a few days since since I fired up Attila. But we also opened up a front in North Africa with the Eastern Roman Empire. So that'll be an important uh, place of engagement for us. I'd say uh, if we can't get food quickly enough, I'll just invade there and hopefully find some farms and such. Ah, the Western Romans have been destroyed. Ah, yes, our troops are deserting. Oh, but we have food now. That's okay. 
Yes, yeah, so we've demolished that building. Let's create sanitation. We have pretty good health here. Though sanitation wouldn't hurt. I'd say let's um let's go with the sanitation. That'll also help with public order. And let's convert. No, I don't want to dismant. I don't want to do that. Wow, I guess there's nothing else I can do with that. Yep, nothing else I can do with that. I'm gonna dismantle it. Convert that to a plaza. Carthago Nova is all right. Public order is doing okay there. The only thing is no food, really. Malacca does um, some good trade in the trade department, at least on, on sea, so I definitely want to do trade jetties there. A nice trading port would definitely help out. A oh, bad autumn in Mauritania. Oh. At your service. He's gained a rank. Oops. I'm, I'm telling you, this interface is just a little less intuitive than the original one, the Rome 2 one. Even though that one was not as intuitive as uh, Shogun 2. Let's, let's do uh, pessimism and uh, conviction. Why not? He's... <laughs> He's a pessimist who has conviction. Oh, our army has begun the siege of Augila. So, let's attack. And, uh, take it. I believe we did sack this town in our last episode. But now I feel like we can uh, just take it. At your command. Yes, it has food. Excellent. Let's repair everything. Kill them all. Oh, if we repair everything. Does that leave a problem? No, no. It's not over yet. For honor and so, Ptolemaeus. Hmm. Yeah, it seems like we've got a lot of cavalry. And something we're missing from this army is missile units. So that is not the perfect situation. So I'd say uh, let's let's just continue the siege. They're going to run out of supplies in seven turns. That's fine. So once we convert all these buildings at Augila, public order should improve and then I'll move on to Paretonium. And then uh, once Ptolemaeus falls, we'll have taken all of Libya from the Byzantines, or the Eastern Romans, I should say. Hopefully our, our Magus here is uh, converting people fast enough here at Leptis Magna. He could use some help. Yeah. We're out, out of priests. So yeah, I'd say things are going okay. Ready for battle. 
We just have to make sure Tarako doesn't revolt too badly. And Carthago Nova is doing alright. So everything's good for now. Except for uh, the province of Mauritania could definitely use a little bit of a garrison or something. Or at least a priestly presence. I might have to do that. In fact, I'll send him back to Tingis so that he'll um, boost my public order there. All right. Let's end the turn. Unassigned tradition. Let's do... Well, we have a lot of... We have missile units. Um, let's do occupation force and self-sufficiency. I just love self-sufficiency. Excellent. Let's end the turn. So... It would appear as though things are a little bit in flux. We're not exactly... We're strong, but our armies are not yet powerful. I mean, I, I think if we, if we were taking on a full-powered force of Attila the Hun, or Visigoths, we would be hard-pressed to muster a good enough army to beat them. But, uh, as we saw with the Yazigis, just a little change in tactics, and uh, we were able to utterly destroy them after they had defeated us the first time. Quella. Famine again. Who's Quella? Maybe that was his wife. Huh. So how is Latin Christianity going up right now? Why is it going down? Huh. Well, anyway. Sweary? Sweary. Oh... That's fine. Ah, we've demolished the cavalry corral. And they are upset with that. Oh, we have to dismantle that too? Fine. Well, we got the waterworks. That's um, improving public order. Public baths really will improve public order. I'd say let's do the uh, public baths. Yeah. Let's go with the... No, we don't have to. We can do it later. Oh. Caledonians. Who cares? They can do whatever they want. I don't know why they're there, though. So, ah, we can improve our fishing port here at Hadramentum, and that'll give us 20 more food, which would be pretty good. Pretty good. Or we could improve the one at Sabrata. But the one at Hadramentum would be cheaper due to the governor. And over here, camel herd, uh, yeah, that'll improve our food by 30. But, uh, yeah, we're losing public order due to our food shortage. So we've got to do something quickly. And it seems like it's going to have to be 
the fishing wharf at Hadramentum. We fight for you, my lord. Oh. oh, we can make the hamlet there. Yeah, let's make the hamlet. Cattle pens? No. Oh, we can make sheep pens. That would be good. And then, uh... Oh, that'll give us a lot of Semitic paganism here. That martyrium, or converting that martyrium. So that's good. Let's buy a little more time there. Let's see what else a Maniasta Barco can find. Go to Crete. See if we can make some friends there. It is an honor to serve you. So, it would seem as though that's all we can do for now. We're not at war with the Western Roman Separatists. Ah. The rebel town here looks vulnerable. If I wasn't so vulnerable, I would go take it. But it's better to wait for now. So let's end the turn. Oh, always happens. Let's do... Yeah, it's got to be cunning in public order. That's what it's got to be. Okay, let's end the turn. See what happens. So... Hmm... Ugh. Famine. How much famine do we have? Oh, we gotta construct something there. It's got to be... Well, we need to have some sort of recruitment going on here. I believe it has to be cavalry. Or, or we can make workshops and make money. We could use some of that. Or we could um, have missile units. Training grounds lead to infantry quarters, legionary defectors. Yeah. Yeah, that would be good. Uh, workshops is cheaper. Oh, Daka has gained a rank. My words are yours to direct. He's irresolute but healthy. Excellent. Encourage mutiny and uh, preach intolerance. Ted Cruz. He's the Ted Cruz of Magi. Construction complete. Construction complete. Uh, reminds me of that famous series, Command and Conquer. I wish they would come out with a new one. Steely Field? Sounds good. Sounds good to me. Let's do it. Then I could just move, uh... Yeah, then I could just move my buddy here. At your command. To the last town in that province. 
Libya. So soon enough we'll have we'll have the food we need in one turn. I'm hoping. Yeah, so uh, Arkamani's presence will help public order there. I forgot the taking of Tamosiga uh, hurt our morale in that province. Okay, so things are looking good. Let's end the turn. So let oh, so at Crete, what is there? The sword was I didn't get to see. But now it's bloodied. In this feud, we offer peace today. Ibdanians? Or the sword tomorrow. Hmm. About, uh... How about, uh, 300? Oh, excellent. At least we got a little cash out of that. I'm not really, uh, up for sending a fleet to Ireland to end the conflict for good. So it, it would seem as though the uh, the Huns are on the move. At least I hope so. It would be nice to... I, I bet if I declared war on the Swebians, that would be really hard on me. But that's why I don't want to do it. Ah, uh, so we're in a bit of dire straits here. We've got food now. Ebdanians? Wow. There were all these Ebdanians here, and they didn't... Uh, they didn't attack us. They could have. My Lord. But now they're just wasting away, which is fine. So at um, Taraco, we can make a courthouse. We can make a city center. That'll improve everything except public order. If we do a Temple of the Moon. That'll really help us out here. Or the public baths. And let's, I say let's hold off for a moment. Oh, Kashta. Oh, we gotta equip you with stuff, man. No, you're equipped. Wow. His wife is smart. Very good. Very good. Wait, so who's at Crete? Ah, the Eastern Romans. They've got a tiny legion there. I wonder if I could take it. Let's see what's at Rhodes. Oh. Aran? What the heck are they doing there? Aran? What the hell is Aran doing there? That's weird. Because that's at the witch's house. Ready for orders. Let's leave the rebels there for another turn. My lord. So we'll have fishing wharves in a moment. Augila, let's uh, convert that to a uh, sheep pen. Yeah, let's do sheep pen. We fight for you, my lord. And uh, in one or two turns, we'll send the army out to this town over there. 
Paritonium. And Ptolemaeus will fall soon enough, not in any rush for that. So I'd say I'll uh, end one more turn, and then that'll be it for this episode. Oh, or maybe I'll upgrade these guys, and then I'll end the episode. Harsiyotef. Let's do Commander-in-Chief. And a Logistician. Excellent. Dangerously low integrity. So let's do self-sufficiency and... Oh. Wait, what am I supposed to do with them? Where's their integrity? Oh, the occupation force. I'm sorry. Instill integrity by destroying 10% of the current army. Wait, where the hell are they? These dudes? Hmm. Perhaps we should send them back here. They're probably sad because they're in a bad spot. They've been in a bad spot for a while. Let's make a trade port there. Ready for order. No, they're okay. I think their integrity will go up. Yeah, it's going up. Even though they're mutinous. Aran, let's... Let's see what... Aran is doing. Yeah, Aran is from here. What the hell? How the hell do they have all of that? Weird. Well, I guess we'll end the turn there knowing that somehow Caucasian Albania has conquered Anatolia. See you then.